Okay, so we're gonna put that in there. That's in there. Let's put that out of the way. Four pieces of sausage. I'm gonna put this up. That is tea. Sweet tea, basically. You see that's cooking? And we're about to flip it. Huh? What are you doing? Recording. Yeah, for YouTube. Mm hmm. And that is my you got nana. Tea bag in here? That is my nana. You got tea bag in here? Yeah. Uh, oops. Yeah, I know. I turned off the wrong one. I know. <laughs> and this over here is. Bacon. Okay, after a little while, you want to make sure that these are done. So you flip that. Well, it's not done yet. You go ahead and do that. Do what, Nana? Yeah, I know. I know. The top of that done, Nana? Mm-hmm. These are? Yeah. Okay. We'll turn that over a little bit more. Alright. Ooh. Sausage. Sausage takes about four to five minutes to cook. Depends on how brown you would want it to be. Wow. Okay.
Rebecca. Do what? The sauce is done, Nana? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm pressing pause on these videos because I don't know how much storage my phone really has for sure. What I'm going to do right now is turn this off for now and get these off and get the bacon ready. Get this bacon out. My nana had it cut in half so it would be easier to cook. Put that in there. More of it out. Okay. Now this is definitely going to pop me, so y'all might hear me in the background. As you can see, the sausage is done. Completely. Now all we got to do is twist these up. Right here. Good old bacon. Okay. What I usually use is a fork for this because I like it really crispy. So knowing me, I'll definitely probably get pot using this size of a fork for that. Yeah. It's already popping, so... Depends on how crispy you want your bacon, it would usually take about five to six minutes possibly. It also depends on what temperature that thing is right there. Which me and my nana like our bacon really crispy, so it's going to be a little bit until this is done. Okay, I'm now going to flip this over and see what it looks like. Ah, uh, come on now. Perfect. Got a thing that's get me too, so might as well hurry up. Ow. Golly. Ouch. Woo. There we go. I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's popping up pretty bad. Dang. Hickory bacon. That's actually very good bacon. It's thick too, so it's by them. Don't forget the sausage. We gotta let this get crispy. Okay, I'm now gonna check the bacon again. Ouch. That felt good. Just kidding, no it didn't. Let that cook a little bit on that one side right there, and take it out. That is crispy. Yeah, perfect. Let it cook a little bit on that side now. And I'm now going to take these out with a fork. <clears throat> Flip them over, make sure I got them done right.
Look at that. That smells good. We're going to go ahead and get more bacon out. Because we love bacon around here. Okay. Alright. This part of the table's clean, so. I'm going to set that there. Set that one right there. Okay. So do this fast because it gets mean. Ouch. Woo. Spicy. I'm cooking three at a time so it don't hurt me as bad. Look at that bacon though. That is delicious. Delicious. And we're going to try flipping these bad boys over. So. I. I Oh wait, no, never mind, not yet, not yet. And now we're gonna flip these. Ouch. Woo! We're going to let those cook the rest of the way on the back, and then we're going to flip them over and make sure that they're good. Now, I don't know how many pieces of bacon I'm going to be making, but I'm not going to record all of it, just in case I burn it. However, I will record me making my type of eggs, scrambled eggs at that. We're going to flip this. Ouch. Yep. Ouch. Golly. Woo! Ouch. Okay, third one. Here we go. Last one. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Ten pieces of bacon. And four sausages. I'm going to have some scrambled eggs. My nan is going to fry herself an egg, so... And we're going to check this. Do it on this side. For a tad bit longer. <clears throat> Let's go over here and look at this. Good crispy piece of bacon. With these. Delicious. That perfect. Okay, and we're gonna get these off of here. Voila! Okay, so I already cracked the eggs. Now what I do is I use a tad bit of this. Some of y'all might not like it, but if you put the right amount in it, it will make it taste like French toast, mostly. So I'm about to do that and get the ingredients for it.
bits of milk so I can have some fluffy to fluffy ugh, fluffiness to it. Salt and pepper. And what I usually do is I just use a fork to kind of stir it up. So I'm gonna switch hands here. Once that's good, sorry I'm doing this with one hand so it's kind of difficult, there we go, put a little bit of pepper in there, some salt, And then a little bit of this. Okay, I'm hoping this ain't backwards or upside down. I put this, I mean, I put the rest of the ingredients in it, which I use this, and milk, cinnamon, and pepper. I turned that back on, so that can warm up. That's bacon and sausage grease in it. I got the bacon done. And the sausage is done too. Was it good, Nana? So I'm going to stir this up right now. Yeah, be careful because I don't want to wind up spilling it. Okay, it stirred up good. I'm going to wait until this warms up. And I will get back with y'all.